I've had so many requests to draw a baby puppy, so this is what we're going to be doing today. It's part of Baby Animal Month, so check out the whole playlist in the description below. To draw our cute puppy, you're going to need some plain white paper, a pencil, an eraser and a black pen. We're going to start off with the puppy's head, which is a circle, just here. So, just drawing very lightly in pencil, we're going to be drawing a circle. You can draw around the bottom of a glass or use a compass or anything to draw your circle. Or if you want to find out how to draw a circle freehand, check out my other video at the top. Now, we're going to add the ear, which is a triangle shape. So, just here in the top right hand corner of this circle, we're going to be drawing a triangle. So, it comes out here comes down here and it comes back up here. So it's not a very accurate triangle but it's just a simple triangle shape. Now we're going to be adding the muzzle. So just here on the left hand side of the, of the circle, beg your pardon, we're going to be drawing the muzzle shape which is just a shape like this coming out to the left and round and back inwards just like so. Remember if I go too quickly, just hit pause and rewind. So now we're going to be drawing the back. So just coming up from this line that we used to do the muzzle, we're going towards the left hand side. And then it slopes and then it comes back inwards. Like that. And then just underneath this part of the muzzle, we're going to be drawing a line coming downwards and then a line coming over to the right hand side and just below this circle, this tr circle, sorry, this triangle, that's going to be where the two paws touch. So I'm just gonna draw a line going upwards like that. And again from here, a line going to the right, a line going out, in and up back up to the dog's head. Now we're going to be adding the eye, so just above where we started the muzzle, just going to add in an eye, and it's this shape. There we go. Okay, I'm going to be switching to pen, but please, please carry on in pencil. This is just so that you can see it better on camera. We're going to be starting off with the nose. So you see where it hits, this line hits the circle? I'm just going to carry on this line, just going upwards a little bit, just like that. And then the rest is going to come down. I'm going to just draw the top of the nose there. So it's just like that. We're then going to be drawing the tongue because the tongue's coming up to lick the nose there. So the tongue sticking out, curves round like that, and then we're going to be drawing the line that comes underneath the tongue, and then tongue curls round, goes back into the mouth there. Okay, so we're now just going to draw the top of the mouth, just like that. Okay, we're going to be drawing the bottom lip. I'm just going to colour this in in black just a little bit here and here in black and then just drawing a couple of like dashed lines because it's really furry. I'm just going to draw the chin just like so. Now we're going to be drawing the big puppy eyes. Oh my goodness they're so cute. So just here Draw a line coming upwards and then a line coming down like that. So Adora wore these humongous big eyes. And then remember to leave a little rectangle of light just there. Okay, I'm just going to draw another tiny little thin line just underneath here. Okay, I'm going to carry on this line just a little bit more. And then, there we go. Now we're going to be drawing the rest of the head. So you can't really see the other eye very well. It's just hidden behind there. But 
we will carry on and draw the head just following this circle shape that we did before but I'm just going to use lots of dashes okay just like this so puppies are actually born blind and deaf and they can't see or hear until they're almost two weeks old so they don't even open their eyes and they rely on their sense of smell to find their mother it's very cute Okay, so just before we hit this triangle shape, we're going to be drawing the ear. The ear will start here, and then I'm just going to draw these dashes, just like this. And some longer dashes just coming down for the bottom of the ear. Then a nice clean line coming all the way up and round. Now for the body of the puppy. So, following this back line that we did before, I'm just going to use those dashes of lines. It's going to go downwards and then it's going to go up again, just here. Okay, so puppies are actually born without teeth. And um, at four weeks old, they start to get their baby teeth and they lose their first set and they're replaced with adult teeth at about four months. So anybody who's had puppies will know all this. Well, I've kept puppies, not had puppies. But anyway, let's draw the bottom foot. So this will actually start here. And then another line there. So we've got the toes. There we go. Just like that. A line there. And then the other foot's just tucked around here. But first of all, we're going to be drawing this front leg. So again, with these fluffy lines, just come in just round like this. And then the bottom there. We're going to start from the top. So just the top of the front paw. And then there's another one here. And it comes round. There's one toe here, another toe here, another toe here, and one like that. Now we're going to be doing the other front leg, so just here, a line coming around. So puppies spend about 15 to 20 hours a day sleeping. Oh, they're so lucky. I'd love to sleep that. Okay, so we're just drawing the toes on this side. And then I'm actually going further inwards than I'd actually done my preparatory line. I've realised that that was a little bit too far across. And then the dashes, just like that. Add some dark underneath there and there too. And then last but not least, we're going to be drawing the other paw that you can just about see. So this paw comes round. It's kind of on its side. Some dashes for the for the tummy area. Okay, so here we're just going to add some detail to this paw. There are the little pads underneath the foot. So if you haven't gone over it in pen yet, go over it in pen now and then erase all the pencil lines. We're now going to be adding the finishing touches. So just a couple of lines just down here, like that. We're going to be colouring in the nose a little bit. So just leaving a little tiny bit in white. You'll see what I mean. Just like that. I'm going to be adding a few dots to show where the whiskers are. There we go. And then 
and just a little bit of fur just coming up around here. I'm just going to add a little bit of shadow in between the toes and underneath the foot. Shadow on either side. And then I'm just going to make it a little bit darker on the end of the ear and then underneath here as well. Tiniest bit darker down here. And here, and just a little bit under the chin. Last but not least, a little bit of dark down there. And there we have our finished puppy drawing. I really hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, check out my whole playlist on how to draw dogs. And here in another playlist is how to draw lots of baby animals. Thanks for joining me. Don't forget to hit subscribe and like if you've enjoyed it. And I hope to see you on the next one. Bye bye.